Hello. Uh. So, I've never done a review before. I'll probably never do one again. But I figured I might as well review the Splatoon 3 Deep Cut plushies because I got them really early. And they mean a lot to me. So yeah, I'm going to try and make this quick. Uh, first shiver. Uh, first, first thing I noticed is that these are really closely in-game models. Uh, yeah, sit, sits down really well. Mostly against surfaces. Uh, yeah, it's really soft. Squishy. Uh, and... She's got another eye. Which is pretty cool. Uh, next is Fry. Uh, yeah, also really accurate to the in-game model. I like the spots back here. Uh, yeah, same with the shiver. Squishy. Uh, very soft. Yeah, the, uh, the eyes and, like, the fangs. R really well done. Uh, she's actually got legs inside of her big baggy pants. And, yeah, there's not really much else for me to say. Pr probably the best, probably the best one is Big Man. He's big. He's the softest and the squishiest. Uh, look at his face. Just like, how could you not love him? So, yeah. Uh. Something, something else I noticed is, unlike all the other Splatoon plushies, they actually have fingers. And unlike the Marina one, uh, they're colored. Uh. And they've got their earrings, and, uh. These, whatever they're called. The only real problem is that sometimes when Big Man's sitting, his hat does this. Yeah, overall, uh, these are really good size. They're really soft. Really close to the in-game models. Uh, and... Yeah. Yeah, I, lo I, I love that a lot. Shipping was a little... Shipping was a little pricey, but... It's from Japan. What are you gonna do? So yeah, uh... Buy them.